Hello, I'm here uh, I'm trying to create a salt water capacitor. I have a glass in here and uh, aluminum foil. And I was watching some videos and I have this aluminum tape. And I <coughs> don't know which one I will, I will use. Maybe I'll try to use the aluminum tape. I don't want to cut the measure. I'm kind of lazy today. So I'll try to make the salt water capacitor with the aluminum tape. And, uh, let's see what will happen. Um, I'm trying to build a spark, spark gap. Tesla coil and I need some high voltage capacitors and I, I don't have yes I, I received uh, two six kilovolt capacitors but I want to try uh, to make a high voltage uh, capacitor so uh, I can have uh, a capacitor and uh, still learn how to make a uh, high voltage track. I think this will do. Let's try to cut this. is on the on the glass on uh, the piece <coughs> here Okay, now two pieces of aluminum tape. The glass is in here. I just don't know if I need to place another one in the middle in here. Because it really got a very small surface of contact between the two. 
I think I'll place another one in the middle. Uh, here we are with the I'll try to take out these bubbles. No, don't need to watch this. Open the wire like a brush. Something like this. And place it in here. Right in the middle. Okay, let's try to do this. Another piece of aluminum tape here. And let's see how this will work. Place you like this. And at the center of the jar. Hope this will work. Yeah. One, one wire is okay. I, I hope this works. What, a, what to put inside? Some people said that just a piece of metal inside the jar would work. Let me try to find something. Well, I found this, this, I don't know the name of this, I forgot the name. And, uh, Uh, 
let me try this. So I just need to fill this up with water and salt. I don't know if it's distilled water or tap water. I'll try with tap water.